Once upon a time there was an engineer. Choo Choo Charlie was his name. We hear. Yo, Mike, it ain't RBI Radio. Be here, corner of Pine Street. That's hybrid hydrocarbon liquid. That could be the diesel fuel. Liquefied petroleum. Four ten seventy five. Here comes the end. Boy, listen to that little rattle in the rail. <laughs> anyway, we'd be here at uh, Pine Street and Cohen Street up here, as you can see the sign back here. So we're gonna go around the area and see if we can get some more action today and We'll be right back with the next uh, clip here. This is Mike at 8 RBI hey, Radio. Mike at 8 RBI Radio. We'll be here at uh, State Route 4 outside of Bellevue. As the last scene, no, I was at Pine Street and some other street. Can't remember the second. I think Cohen or something. Same train that went by Norwalk, but now we're outside of Bellevue. So we're going to take a look. As you can see, they are operational. Hey, that's an older one. Real Grande. I think I do remember the dispatcher mentioning that local before. And the wind is blowing good out here. That's 33 degrees. Some of you probably wondered, what the hell am I doing out here? 33 degree weather. Well, doing my best to bring you the videos.
Same red cars, they went by at their other crossing. Yeah, these are going to Bellevue Yard. It's just too bad I can't get access though to see what really goes on in the yard though. They got everything, no trespassing, can't get in there. The only way you can get a view of it is a freaking drone. I think that might be one of my next steps in the future. about the shaking wind is blowing right by me <laughs> again hydrocarbon liquid cars and there's some liquid petroleum in here too Sorry about that. There she goes. Okay, well, that's one here for uh, State Route 4 outside of Bellevue, Ohio. Always remember, love to get the best of They sometimes don't work. These are not working properly. Get stuck on the railroad track, blow sign. Call that number immediately. Every second counts. 911 is too delayed. We're going to head on down State Route 4 to another crossing between Norfolk Southern. Another kind of neat looking crossing there. So we'll be right back. Hey, Bug 8 RBI radio back at you. I just missed the uh, train at uh, Route 4 crossing uh, a little bit, but I went down here to this little place called Siam. I've been here once before. This guy was sitting here standing by till the Norfolk uh, crossed the Diamonds over here so we're gonna take a look there's the diamonds over there and he's proceeding over here now down behind me facing the other direction there is another train coming so let's get this one that looks like 37 42 I can't tell yet Thirty-two forty-two. Hey, at least the wind ain't as bad here.
gave me a salute. <laughs> and it looks like we got some rock up here, some kind of rock. Sand or something. It ain't rock salt though. Got to get a little closer to block the wind by the car. Right down there is the diamonds. Maybe I can sneak on down there and get closer though uh, when the next train coming. Definitely a lot of rock up there. Looks like limestone or something. I do see the end down there. There's a big chunk of rock up there. Wow. <laughs> you can tell there's a lot of weight there, man, oh man. on some of these cars, I do say that, yeah, listen to them. That sounded like a dragging brake shoe. Listen on them cars, they look brand new. Maybe they're empties. And we do have a sticker here 1987. Okay, that's that alcohol stuff I mentioned before. And there she goes. Okay, well, we're going to try to get a shot down there by Route 4 later on here, but unfortunately, uh, I missed the uh, one that went back here. It was Norfolk Southern. Although, these tracks here crossing here is Norfolk Southern. And way down yonder, I believe there is a train down there. Yeah, I do. So anyway... Uh, we'll be back with you for the next clip. This is Mike at 8 RBI hey, Radio. Hey, Mike at 8 RBI Radio, still here at Siam. And we have another one still coming.
Starting to feel the wind chill already. <laughs> Looks like I might see the end already approaching. But from behind me, I still have that other train coming. It's been sitting down there a while, but I did notice the uh, light was closer now. I don't know if you can see it in the video, but you can see that light down there. You can see he's crossing over right here. It's been somewhere with a lot of snow. I can see snow on there. Look at that. <laughs> I guess out by Conneaut, out by Ashton Buell, they got 17 inches of snow last night. I'm glad it didn't happen around my neck of the woods. I don't like shoveling snow. <laughs> And there she goes across the diamonds over there. Look at that, a little bit of rock and roll action down there. All right, we're gonna stand by for this other one to come along, so we'll be right back. Hey, back at you again. I'm sitting inside the junk heap mobile here. As you can see, my windows are a little bit cleaner. <laughs> anyway, here comes that train that uh, I was telling you about in the previous clip here. And he's moving. Roll this window down so I get a shot as it goes by. Can you blame me if I don't want to get out of the car? It's so cold. We got 32.95 on these cars here. That's that uh, hydrocarbon liquid. I think it really is uh, diesel fuel. Not sure. It could pertain to many other things. Tank cars appear to have nothing on them. A little rock and roll there. 
there's a little low spot right there. Right there, there's a little dip there. I see the end approaching. There she goes. Okay, hey, if you like what you've seen here, uh, give me a thumbs up, like, share, subscribe. Check out Busted Boy 2 uh, channel, uh, Try Goglin, Elliot Walcott, Dave that's railroading, and John too. Give a thumbs up on the men and the women of the railroad to keep America moving. We're gonna see if we can get a shot here at uh, Route 4, Norfolk Southern. We'll see. We'll be Hello, ahead. Mike. It ain't RBI Radio. We'll be here at State Route 4 at Township 106. This is an angle. This is kind of an angle crossing. This will be Norfolk Southern. Yeah, this train will be crossing down where I was at previous, uh, Siam. But I wanted to get a shot here at this crossing, particularly, it's really kind of different. like a little weight there 2056 I wonder what that is I'll have to look that up but like I said this is a long angle crossing right here
Yeah, this train uh, originated out of Bellevue. Might go back up to Bellevue and look around again. I don't see the end in sight at all down there. Anyway, this line will be taking you down by Marion that I was at uh, about a month ago. I see the end in sight. Can't happen too soon with my cold hands. <laughs> yeah, and there's the end down there. Here we are, uh, did make it here, State Route 4, just outside of Siam, south of Bellevue. Anyway, all goes the same from the last previous clip, though, and if you like, share, subscribe to the channel, though, uh, appreciate it. I'm going to see if we get some more clips. If not, you know why. This is my Gay Mike Get RBI, RBI Radio. We be here at State Route 62 crossing and back down. That way we have a train coming. Hey, I ain't doing too bad just looking out the window here. And boy, is he booking. or coal in this uh, train going by. All days, the temperature went down to 32. So it's cold out here with the wind chill. Look up that way. Yeah, if this wind chill wasn't so bad, I'd be standing outside. And you can't use a camera with freaking gloves, that's for sure. And there she goes. Here at State Route 62. Always remember this, so be safe around the crossings. Always look and listen. 
train gets a second chance. If you ever get stuck on the railroad crossing, there's a sign right there. And always call that sign immediately. 911 is too delayed. Yeah, it must have been that, must have been a dispatcher up in Bellevue, but anyway, uh, as I was saying, uh, check out Busted Boy 2's uh, channel, though, uh, try goggling with Elliot Wilcott, Dave that's railroading, and Jawtooth, of course, and uh, give a thumbs up for the men and women of the railroad that keep America moving. We'll see you next time. I may go to Bellevue. If I don't come back, you know why. See you next time. Hey, Mike, it ain't RBI radio back at you. Came up to Bellevue anyway. And look at what I got. Can't remember the name of the street behind me, but I'll list it in the... Oh, he's going to go that way. Dad out of the way. Yeah, this guy must have came up right after I left one sixty two. Looks to me like he's gonna head westward there. Hey, at least my windows are cleaner this time. <laughs> A draft coming in the window here. Don't know if you can hear that or not, or hear the wheels squealing. I don't recall it was only one end, uh, local uh, towing this or a couple though. I don't think I've seen a DPU today.
What if he's gonna stop? He's going slower and slower. I got a couple of the train devices going off here. One of them's got to be this one. Probably the other one could be in the yard somewhere or sometime today earlier this Wheeling Lake area is supposed to depart from here and head back to Heartland Center. Down there you can see the end approaching. Creeping along. There's almost going over here. We can get a little bit there. That overpass would be uh, State Route 269. I just came over that to get down in here. But anyway, there she goes. Was a luck, uh, lucky catch there. Uh, came come into Bellevue here, so. Okay. Anyway, uh, hope you enjoy what you've seen here so far. So we'll catch you next time. Give a thumbs up for the men and women of the railroad to keep America moving. This is Mike at 8 RBI Radio. Yeah, back at you again. Started to leave the area, though. Then heard another train horn, though. In fact, I'm actually uh, near the same road as the last clip. Uh-oh. That didn't sound good, like something failed somewhere. Ugh. China shipping, you know what I say to that? They can send that clear back to China. We don't want their junk. You ever go to Wallet Mart though? That's all you find is Chinese junk. That's why I hate China though, because they're junk. And why we deal with China, I'll never know. China's never been our friends. Anyway, I'm not going to get into the politics of everything, though. Somebody told me don't be talking politics, but that's my opinion of Chinese products. It's garbage. Yeah, I just missed the lead engine here just by probably a minute.
either that's the lead engine I hear sound on the horn or there's another one on the track on the other side of this. Yeah, I think it's the lead engine of this. Yeah, the defect detector around here somewhere. Actually, it's on the other side of this. Could be that Wheeling Lake here, uh, heading back, uh, don't know. <laughs> hey, but at least we got a collection of all three railroads today. Uh, anyway, it's a good thing. Yeah, that is a different train. But I don't, yeah, I hear it. see it there uh, on the other set of tracks. <laughs> if you look right under these cars, you can see the other one passing by there. Either it's coming into the yard, I think it's a little too fast, or it might be going points north. One of these days I'm going to get the understanding of Bellevue around here, though. But Man, I'd sure like to get some hump yard action, though. But Again, they got everything, no trespassing, like they're trying to hide something. Maybe mainly for uh, safety of the people. Uh, can't blame that, I guess. But darn it, maybe I should go over on the other side and take a look, see. Anyway, here comes the end of this one. And you can see the other one going by. I'd go up. Oh, I guess I can do it. It 
let's head up there and get a little closer. Yeah, make sure I don't get hit by the side here. And it looks clearer. Yep. I did look and listen though, I just it's out of tracks. Check out this old brick, uh, probably a switch tower or something from years ago. Since been abandoned. Probably should have been driving though and holding a handheld device while driving, but doing what I'm doing. But since there ain't no traffic on this road here. <laughs> What's the harm when nobody coming? Yeah, I don't think this train's going to the yard at all. Seems to be picking up speed. If you remember a while back that Mad River uh, museum tour and the classic cars were there's that stinky portage John that they were had on the front of that tractor that went by. Wonder if they cleaned it out. We got 1075 on that car right there. It's 3295, 1075. I don't know, it seems like this camera is stuttering or something a little bit. Sure looks like it. Might need, I don't know, I got these new glasses though and it seems to me I can see down the road a lot better with them off than with them, with them on. <laughs> but up close here I gotta look at the camera though, I do need the bicycle focals. <laughs> That line came from Shep Howard from the Three Stooges years ago, and I always remember the bicycle vocals. Twenty two oh nine, that's a little different. Twelve thirty. Back a little bit ago I did look up the one unusual car, but I can't remember what it Terra to the Hydrate or I can't remember now. I did look up one of these cars that went by with the hazmat though, and it was one. Of the, it was that small tank on a kind of like a flat car. And there is cars and these auto racks. I do see cars in there. At least a couple of them was. These look like it might be empty. I think that one had cars in it. Boy, getting a lot of footage today, <laughs> golly. <laughs> this one's elapsed uh, since I started this uh, video is uh, going into 11 minutes. 
Now we're at 12 minutes even. These are definitely empty. And there goes the end. There she goes. Okay, I think I got more than enough uh, today, so anyway, uh, I'll probably throw this in the bonus footage. I think that's what I'll do. But anyway, we'll see you next time. Be safe and give a thumbs up once again for the men and women of the railroad that keep America moving. This is Mike at 8RBI Radio. We'll see you next time.